What's good, everybody? My name is Polo. Hope you're doing well. And today I am checking out, for the first time, Chris Cornell's cover of Led Zeppelin's Thank You on the Howard Stern Show. Do me a big favor and like the video if you like these type of videos. Let's go. Perform the song Thank You over all over Led Zeppelin songs. What does that mean to you? Um, it was just, to me, it was kind of almost uncharacteristic of other stuff off that album. Um, it sounds like a 60s pop song to me, the way that they have it arranged. Um, and it, it's almost like that would have been, with any other band, would have been their biggest hit. But A 60s pop song, okay. Because it was Led Zeppelin and, and the album was so unbelievable and it's their first album, he almost kind of passed over it. I know, and it's, it's a great song for you to choose to yeah. do when you decide to do another artist. And would you do a little of that for us? Sure. All right, here it is. sun refused to shine I would still be loving you If mountains crumbled to the sea There would still be you and me Can kind of woman I give you my heart can woman nothing more Little drops of rain Whispers of the pain Tears in love lost in the days gone by I love you strong It's you there is no wrong Together we shall go until we die Inspiration is what you are to me Inspiration, look and see And so today in my world it smiles Your hand in mine, we walk for miles And thanks to you this will be done Cause you to me are the only one Happiness no more be Happiness, I am glad Little drops of rain Whispers of the pain Tears and love lost in the days gone by I love is strong With you there is no wrong Inspiration is what you are to me Inspiration, look and see If the sun refused to shine I would still be loving you If mountains crumbled to the sea There would still be you and me
I think this is the part where YouTubers who do reactions be like, oh my God, that was so amazing. <laughs> um, I'm not going to do that because I, you know, I try to be honest, as honest as I can. And if I'm being honest, this performance didn't really move me personally. You know, um, I think that Chris Cornell is gifted in his singing. He sang this flawless. His guitar playing was flawless. Uh, I'm always a person that kind of picks up on melodies, and there was nothing that really moved me about this particular performance. Granted, I have never heard the original version of this one uh, from Led Zeppelin, which typically doesn't really factor in how I feel about a cover. Okay, even if I'm just listening to it objectively, when I'm listening, I'm, I'm actually just listening to the song. Uh, an example of that is Tool did a cover of a Led Zeppelin track that was mind blowing to me. Okay, after listening to that track, I checked out the original version from Led Zeppelin, which I reacted to, and I was impressed even further. Now, I, of course. I'm going to have an even bigger appreciation to the person that's covering it as well. If they can even come anywhere near the um, entertainment value, greatness, or whatever word you want to use of the original song, the fact that they can even come close to it, uh, which I think they did. And I got, I got to remember, the name. I can't remember the name of the song. I'll try to put it in, put it here, or you guys can put it in the comment section if you know what I'm talking about. I'm bad with names. But my point is, I loved both versions. And in this case, I'm hearing... Chris covered this one, and I haven't heard the original, but from this particular performance, there was nothing about it that made me go, I want to hear it again. Okay, now mind you, I've reacted to a few things from Soundgarden and, and, and Chris Cornell and some of his work, and I like it, but even Michael Jackson has songs I don't like. Even Jay-Z has songs I don't like. You know, even, well, two doesn't have any songs I don't like. <laughs> uh, so, you know, that's, that, that's kind of how this one works. And this was a supporter request uh, and a generous donation at that. So thank you. Thank you for your support. And this will show some of you who think that um, I may say I like a song simply because someone sent in support uh, for me to check out a song. I'm still going to give my honest opinion uh, because I don't want to make anything up. And I'm going to tell you, you know, you guys know when I really, really like a song, unless it's like a really sad song or it's uh, like the opera, I'm typically pausing the hell out of the video. Um like, I think there was a song I did with Simon and Garfunkel, Bridge Over Troubled Water. I didn't say anything in that video, but that entire time I was blown away by the performance. So, um, yeah, but most of the time I'll be pausing it a lot if I, if, if I like the track. Uh, and this is a case where I thought he sang it incredibly. As good as anyone can sing it, he's gifted. He's one of the greater singers that I've heard. Uh, just at this time, didn't do it for me. If you guys want me to react to the original Again, let me know in the comments section if I should do the reaction, like the video, subscribe, all that good stuff. That'll tell me to come back and check out the original Led Zeppelin record. They are undefeated so far. So it'll be weird if I don't like the original of this one because it'll be the first one from Led Zeppelin that, that I wasn't feeling, but I definitely wasn't feeling this cover. Um, anyways, I appreciate your time as your time is very valuable and hope you guys have a great day. Peace.